Hello guys, today we're going to change the BIOS or memory battery or whatever it's called on my uh, old uh, Dell Latitude E4200 because every time I start the computer machine I get this message and I need to push F1 and then Windows is starting this is very annoying. So now we're going to change the battery, which is a small package like this. If we can make this uh, Canon focus. There we go. And it even has my name on it. Amazing, eh? All the way from the USA to Norway. This tiny little piece. Okay, let's turn the computer off. To open the computer, we need to have a small flat screwdriver and it's a small notch down here, which we put the screwdriver in and it will snaps open. And here we go. One latch and two latches. And here we have a some small screws, one here and one up here. Here, the keyboard is loose. And now, is it for the battery? Which is here, under here. Uh, here's a small plug that holds it in place. You just need to make that come off really easily. Like that. And then it is glued to the bottom with a small dual sided tape. Ooh, here we go. What's important is this tiny little plug because there are different plugs on the batteries you can find on eBay, so make sure you get the correct plug. Like this one, which comes all the way from the America. Okay, it's a little hard to get in place, and here we go. And here we go. And then, you just need to reassemble everything. And we should be good to go. Oh, these screws are so tiny. This looks good so far. Then it's this uh, plastic piece. Okay, let's start the computer and see what's happening. And here we go. Fantastic. Everything's okay. 
So there you have it. If you have a Dell Latitude E4200, you can easily change the BIOS battery yourself, which looks like this. And remember the correct plug, it's important. That's all guys, see you, bye bye.